Long live Manipo! Long live Manipo! Long live Manipo! We don't need food package, we need human peace package. You see, that is very important for us. We are really thinking for a solution, for a peace. We are peace-loving people. And that's why I, on behalf of all my colleagues here, all my friends and the fraternity of art and culture, request the President of India, the Prime Minister of India, to solve the problem and we request all the politicians, all the cabinet ministers to understand about this small state. And we need a human solution. We need peace. And that too, from the government of India, if the state government is doing a little bit, but it is not enough for us, the center should look after us properly and we don't really feel it uh, more. I always feel that this time particularly, I feel that we are not even second class citizen of this country. We are third class citizen of our own state. So once you start sitting over the solution for peace, then we have to think about the people who have suffered and uh, of, of the people, the orphans, the, the people who died, the family burnt uh, the houses, this and that, everything put together. But at the same time, we want a solution of how these communities, how this, uh, the, the, the fire flared and the, these communities started doing this. And we would like to go to that situation knowing that. And after knowing that, what will happen? We will try to mend. We will try to mend the situation and bring our brothers and sisters together to, have to live in peace together. Otherwise, I can't say what will be the solution because I am not a god. But if we try, I think we will. Definitely get a solution for this.